from homicide number 38 from 2012. As you're aware, uh, Mr. Jayesh Pachutari, a gas bartender at the Shell gas station located at Marley Avenue and Rosemont Avenue, was struck and killed by a vehicle we believe um, to have been driven by Mr. Max Edwin, to have been 39 years old. Through investigation, we have determined that Mr. Tudovin is responsible for the murder of Mr. Pajapani. We have obtained a Canada-wide warrant for the arrest of Mr. Tudovin on the charge of second-degree murder. We are requesting the public's assistance in determining the whereabouts of both Mr. Tudovin and the vehicle used in the murder of Mr. Pajapani. That vehicle is described as a 2000 to 2003 silver Isuzu Rodeo. Any information on this incident, please call the Homicide Squad at 416-808-7400 or Crime Stoppers at 416-222-TEST. This investigation, of course, is still um, ongoing, so I will be limited in, in the information that I need. Is that vehicle you believe he's driving the vehicle that you believe he's driving the night of homicide? Yes. And can you tell us what, what changed this from a suspicious death investigation into a homicide? Uh, just uh, witnesses in the area. We've had a lot of people come forward. There are people that view the incident happen. And there are people in uh, both of the buildings uh, in the immediate vicinity of the gas floor or high rise condominiums. And they were able to uh, see. Uh, evidence of the incident occurred and uh, did call the police and uh, offer their assistance to us. Do you think he's still in the city or have any indication of the murder? Uh, we don't know if he's in the city. Um, we believe that he has uh, contacts in Montreal. He may go to Montreal. Um, and outside of that, uh, he could be anywhere at this point. Do you have family, friends there? Can you elaborate on this contact? He does have associates in Montreal. And he has, uh, there is currently a warrant uh, before the courts in Montreal for oh, oh, what charges. Uh, I'm, I'm not sure. It's written in French. So. Mm -hmm. did, he, did he have any outstanding warrants in Toronto by trial, please? Uh, he does have outstanding warrants, and again, it's for theft. Oh, and for theft of gas? And when, when, when are those from? When, when do those allegedly have? Um, some are from this year. Can you say when? Uh, no, do you know any? He may have two to three months already before the arrest. What is the more styles uh, in terms of he pumped up and just drove away? I don't know, I'm sorry. Is this his vehicle that he's driving? Uh, at this point in time, we can't determine if it's his vehicle or if it's a stolen vehicle. Because you did say that there may be stolen plates on there, so. Either maybe he is known to uh, um, use a stolen any other questions? Can you tell us anything about Mr. Pajapati? Mr. Pajapati was simply a man doing his job. Um, and this unfortunate incident, he's a, he's a married man, he's a family man, and he's known to the community in that area, which is um, why we have stepped up uh, thankfully in the health of the country. Any other questions? I already. Uh, Sort of shall give a disclaimer about their employees, uh, you know, trying to uh, deter any sort of gas death like that. Any any comments along those lines? I don't know anything about Shell's policies. I, I mean, uh, I mean, disclaimer. as yourself, as a as a police officer, and as someone who's been, you know, looking now at someone who's dead for, you know, hundred and change of gasoline. Any any no, advice I, to? I don't have any comment in relation to Shell's policies. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm referring to, uh, if you care to make a comment to maybe other people that work at, at similar jobs. We've seen people shot and killed for small things. Uh, any no, comments no, about no, how, no, how no, worth it or not worth it it is? It's not worth it. It is not worth it to go after somebody um, for $112. Can you just tell us again the, the sequence of events? Uh, he pulls up, comes to gas, is Mr. Mr. Pajapati outside at this point? Can you say, at what point he comes outside and what he did after that? Mr. Petropati is the uh, attendant at the gas bar station, so he's inside um, the, the booth uh, at the time uh, where Mr. Tudovic goes up and um, pumps the gas. Um, 
and he wanted to think as a large amount um, for him to drop all the junior five cents. Um, and he, uh, he then, obviously, Mr. Trechpaddy comes out of the booth, and there's contact with him, obviously, uh, to the vehicle strikes him. And uh, Mr. Trechpaddy is obviously true. Does he come out of the booth after Mr. Trudeau gets into the vehicle? Yes. So he, is, it the, is it your assumption that he's coming out to visit Mr. Trudeau? I can't go into all of that. I don't know. Okay. 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 Thank you very much for coming. Um,